Carl. My name is Carlos Torella. We're Team Gifted Tones. Uh, we're inside the Eastfield Mall. Started in East Long Meadow. We're growing with the city, so now we're in the mall, uh, in a way bigger venue. We were commissioned by the city to do this piece right here, so if you guys want to take a quick uh, halfway intermission look at it, okay? Work in progress. Okay, so the idea of the painting is um, taking something old and bringing it back to life again. Kind of like the upgrade or kind of like, you know, just revamping our city. So with, with that in mind, take something that we dear that we take dear to our culture. You know, it's a farm worker, so we take the, the iconic idea of the farm worker and put it on display but with a nice background so in that the youth of our city can see this and, and inspire and be, you know, inspired by the city to create and do great work. It'll be uh, pretty much is gonna on one side will be the booster. Um, and then on the other side will be the coqui, which um, comes from Puerto Rico. Yeah, it's a, it's a little tropical frog that's indigenous to the island. So if you're from Puerto Rico, you'll know about this little frog. And it sings coqui so beautifully, so you know, they named it coqui. Uh, well, born, from, born in Springfield, yeah, born in our race. family, my family is from Sidra and uh, Villalba. My family is from Ponce. So. And how did you get into art? Like, how, when did you start spray painting? Uh, it started uh, as a love, as a, as a passion, as a little kid. Um, I had my, my mother really support me and uh, kind of push me forward throughout my high school years. And even though I did the wrong things in high school, I had the, the faculty and the support of, of the school system to right. make my dreams come true, you know, take it from the streets to canvas. So being able to do something like that can actually inspire other kids to do the right thing, you know. I went to the high school of commerce, class of 96. And he started off like tagging, doing graffiti? Yeah, yeah, um, yeah doing... Got busted by one of the principals. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, long story short, uh, she redirected my whole art career, you know, with kind of like, you know, you're not going to get in trouble your senior year. We're going to dedicate the hallway, your art hallway, your last year. So with that in mind, I mean, I couldn't get in trouble and that really pushed me forward and I ended up getting honors and ended up getting a scholarship that pushed me to go to an art institute. Right. So being a graduate of the art institute of Fort Lauderdale with a bachelor's degree in media arts and animation, it leads me well-rounded in all aspects of art, from street art to computer design, I mean, you name it. This is like a, a dream come true. 